some milk. Hello everybody. Have you ever played the game or watched the movie called Land of the Dead brought to the fiddler screen? In this video, we are diving into the intriguing world of Land of the Dead brought to the fiddler screen, both the game and the movie adaptation. We will explore both of them to uncover the origins of the term fiddler screen. So let's get started. The game Land of the Dead Road to the Fiddler's Green takes us into a post-apocalyptic world infested with zombies. We step into the shoes of Jack, a farmer facing the undead menace. Jack's mission is to survive the relentless zombie attacks battling his way through different environments and confronting hostile human factions. His ultimate goal is to reach Fiddler's Green, a rumored safe haven. The Land of the Dead movie immerses us in a similar post-apocalyptic setting. We witness a society divided between the wealthy living in Fiddler's Green, a fortified city, and the less privileged struggling for survival. As the city faces a new threat from intelligent and organized zombies led by Big Daddy, the story follows the protagonist Riley Dembo and his group of scavengers as they navigate the dangers within the city and the growing conflict with the undead. Both the game and the movie share the same post-apocalyptic world ravaged by zombies. They explore themes of survival, social division, and internal conflicts. Additionally, they both feature fortified cities, action-packed combat against hordes of zombies, and a diverse cast of characters with unique skills. In the movie, we witness the struggles of Riley Denbo and his group as they venture outside the city, discovering the zombies' increasing intelligence. They find themselves caught between the growing conflict with the undead and the internal power struggles within the Fiddler's Green. The movie examines survival, social inequality, and the fight for control in a post-apocalyptic society. In the game, we follow Jack, a farmer thrust into the midst of a zombie outbreak. Jack fights his way through hordes of zombies, encounters hostile human factions, and embarks on a journey towards Fiddler's Green. Along the way, he faces various challenges, navigates different environments, and ultimately seeks safety and refuge from the zombie-infested world. The term Fiddler's Green refers to a safe heaven or a paradise in maritime folklore, often associated with the afterlife for sailors. It represents an idyllic place where sailors who have died at sea find eternal rest and peace. Fiddler's Green is depicted as a joyful and abundant realm free from the hardships of the sea. The color green may symbolize a thriving and abundant environment. Green is associated with nature, growth, and renewal, representing lush vegetation and vitality. It might have been chosen for its poetic effect and cultural associations with luck, prosperity, and magical realms. In the real world, Fiddler's Green is deeply rooted in maritime folklore. It signifies a mythical afterlife or paradise for sailors who have passed away at sea. It is described as a joyous and peaceful place where sailors enjoy eternal good weather, plentiful food and drink, and endless music and dancing. Fiddler's Green is an enduring concept in nautical traditions and tales. So, what do you think about this magical place called Fiddler's Green? Comment below. I hope you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video.